I'm Madison and I live in my roller skates. How long have you been living in your roller skates? Um, I've been living in my roller skates probably since I was about two or three. Um, I started learning how to walk and I just automatically didn't like the way that the ground felt. It was way too flat, not as fun. There was no room for me to you know, glide and slide without having to pick up my feet and actually walk. How did you start roller skating? Uh, I started roller skating because my sisters took me to a roller rink when I was very young, about the age two or three, and I got my own roller skates and we started roller skating every single day, all the time. We went after school, after dinner, on the weekends. We were just always at the roller rink and I just really loved the way that it made me feel, how fast I could go, you know, I could run into people and fall and just have a lot of fun and so I just fell in love with it because I decided that you know my feet were just way too overrated and just not as fun. What do you love about roller skating? Um, I would probably say that my roller skates are basically like my family and my sisters. Um, they are named Cosmo and Wanda so Cosmo and Wanda go everywhere with me. Literally they live with me, they live on me. Like, I wouldn't even consider myself having feet. They're just my roller skates. Um, I love the way that I can be on the ground and it kind of feels like I'm flying. And I just go really fast. I go wherever I want to. Um, and I can do pretty much everything in them. What is a typical day like for you in your roller skates? Well, since I live in them, I basically do everything with them. I go to sleep in them, wake up, shower, still with my roller skates, brush my hair, put on makeup, pick out my clothes, still on my roller skates, and then I'll usually um, get in the car, drive. I do drive with my roller skates, you know, I wouldn't recommend everyone doing it. It does take a lot of practice, but once you get the hang of it, it's almost like you're rollerblading in the car. Um, and then I get to class, rollerblade on campus, go to school. Um, I do get kind of a lot of stares when I rollerblade around campus, but I feel like it's the same as the line people who just run over everyone and just go as fast as they want. You know, the rollerblades have a little bit more control. So after school, I'll go home, cook myself something to eat, enjoy a nice TV show, play with my dog, put on some music, and then the day starts again. Do you ever take off your rollerblades? No, never. I mean, I have shoes because it's like, you know, everyone has to have shoes, I guess, but no, I never take them off. I have like a, a wall of shoes and it's kind of like my decoration just to like remind myself if I wanted to take them off, I do have another option, but the past, you know, 20 years, it's never been that option. Always roller skates. What advice do you have for your fellow roller skaters? Definitely you do you. Keep going. Let the haters hate. You know, don't take any negativity just because you're different than someone else you know rollerblading has so many great benefits there's so much you can do with them you have way cooler shoes than anyone else obviously um, you know like Heelys they were they were like Heelys except they have four wheels except for one which is like four times as cool um, definitely just you know keep on roller skating don't give it up and live your life would you encourage other people to live in their roller skates? Oh yeah, definitely, absolutely. If you have roller skates, definitely try them out, you know, 24 hours, 48, 48 hours. Um, just see what you like. If you don't like it, you know, move on. It's not for you. But definitely you get so many calories burned while you're roller skating everywhere. Um, you're constantly using your core, your muscles. So it's just like, what can you have to lose by roller skating all the time?